Damn. Look at that. Mm-mm-mm. Oh, yeah, I'm getting him. Boom. I mean, every one of those shots hit that rubber dummy, right? Five rounds of 22 Magnum at that, at that distance is going to do exactly what you need it to do. Yeah. All right, Jason. All right, let's take a look at this little tiny baby backup gun here. So this is the uh, North American Arms Pug. It's got this little uh, pocket holster in it. This is kind of ridiculous. It's got uh, Trigicon night sights on it. It's got a whole grip. And wait till you see what's inside of it. So is this classified as a little person gun? Oh, it could be a, little, it could, well, be a full size person. Yeah. So I've got gold dot ammunition for this little tiny uh, revolver. Wait, it needs good ammo. This, yeah, this is gold dot. You know, this is the classic, classic uh, carry ammunition. Mm-hmm. So that's pretty darn fancy, right? So I've been known to carry this as a backup gun now and again. It's pretty fun. It's a, definitely a conversation piece. It, I used to carry it around in the yard with some snake shot in it. Yeah. Uh, and that definitely does the trick. Um, but uh, I've been looking for something super lightweight to carry on the motorcycle and I have a replacement for this one now and I've been carrying this gun that I'm going to show you next on the motorcycle and you even know it. Okay? Yeah. So this comes from Sandy Manufacturing, the same guys who make the, uh, the DP-12. Just yep, I weird. love those guys. Yeah, they make weird stuff, right? So here we go. This is the switch gun now before i before i show you that why it makes it so special let me show you this uh this pocket knife that i've got here i carry this uh, i've been into microtex a lot lately they're fantastic knives mm -hmm. uh, but this is the stitch this is my absolute favorite microtech it is a, a side folding automatic right so i'm going to push this button and out comes the super awesome blade right wow yeah that so well, you like that? Yeah, I do. But yeah. which one do you like better? <laughs> <laughs> well, you, you know what? Actually, this knife is probably more than this gun is. I wouldn't doubt it. Uh, but anyway, um, so here's the switch gun, uh, and it does the same thing as this 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 uh, stitch switch and stitch or stitch and switch. Uh, you just pull this little lever right here, and out pops the gun. You get a nice full-size grip on there, unlike the little pug here. Right. And this is how you close it. Now, I'm going to show you why I like this one for carrying on the motorcycle, bouncing around in your jacket pocket or whatever, right? Mm -hmm. So it's also got one of those half, it does half cock, but it also has one of those little safety notches. So you, what you do is you, you load the gun and then you let the hammer down in between one of those safety notches. Right. Okay. Uh, and then in this gun, you just hope that the hammer doesn't somehow get cocked all the way back and, you know, it's bad news in your pocket. It's never happened in all the years I've carried this gun, but you never know. Yeah. Let's take a look at this one. When you close this one, no matter how hard you pull or press, it's not going to go back into... Uh, you can't cock the firearm. Right. And when it goes back, it doesn't go back to the 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 um, the, the safety spot. It goes to half cock. So you're gonna go around half cocked all day long. All day long. <laughs> which is probably the best place to be because yeah. that that hammer is not going to hit those rounds. Right. The chances of you you giving enough pressure to 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 cock that hammer is is minute but the fact that it can't cock all the way and then also the 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 uh the trigger is not exposed right it's probably the safest firearm on the planet. i agree so yeah fold it up one more time man. one more time look at that i gotta point at myself but i literally just put it in my pocket yeah that's pretty cool buddy yeah i don't know what I don't know if the bad guy's going to laugh at you when you, you know. Oh, they'll run for their lives. Probably. They're like, this guy's not stable if he's carrying something like that. Yeah. Yeah. But 22 Magnum is no slouch. No. 
You want to shoot it? Yeah. All right. So it loads exactly the same way as the North American arms. Safety notch. All right. I'm going to turn the hammer back. I mean, the camera off and put my ears on, buddy. Okay. All right, here we go. Dang. Uh, you could do that and catch, let it fly up in the air and then catch it midair. Yeah. That would be cool, wouldn't it? Hey. You guys better run now. <laughs> they going down. Where's Greg? Oh, he's He's down there taking a day off here. We could have used him for this little this little revolver. Yeah, I know. That's a very, very uh, light trigger there, Mark, so be careful. Yeah. Yeah. I think I ought to really grip it. No, I, it's a, you're in single action, though, so. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. All right, let's see here. I can't even see the end of it here. Damn, that's loud. You gotta it's like that. the noisy firecracker. You gotta pull that trigger, don't you? Yeah. I'm gonna hit that middle of that target. Right? Okay. I hit the right, left of it, didn't I? That's all you got. That's five. Grab a dog. So when you get ready to put it back in your pocket. Yeah, you gotta push it up. There you go. Bam. You just stick in your pocket, right? Yep. What about that? Yeah. I didn't, I mean, it's not very big. No. Nope. I wonder I like if it's it. in this little, here, let me see that for a second. I got this little, uh, let me switch it around. I've got this little, uh, it's 511. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> It fits right in there, doesn't it? It does. How about that? Maybe uh, 511 and uh, Standard Manufacturing could do a collaboration. Yeah. Yeah. Are you selling jeans now, too? No. Yeah. I mean, I would. Yeah. Yeah. You got jeans like that, right? Uh, I don't have any. What? Like no. Nope. Well. I, I had to shoot it now. Yep. Yeah. Tell you what, I think we had a you got one round that you, you didn't don't shoot. You get you don't go through a lot of ammo shooting like this right here. No, this is a good one. This was a good one for the the current climate, you know. Yeah. So I had to steal this ammo out of the out of your. Uh, I'm just kidding. I bought this one. Uh, again, I'm going to ask you uh, which one do you like better? Of which I, I will never. I absolutely like this switch way better yeah, than the. Yeah, I uh, too. The, than the pug only because it's safer right yeah it is safer yeah i mean the pug is not dangerous by any stretch of the imagination uh as long i mean i've got it in this nice little pocket holster it's made for you can't just you can't just put guns in your pocket and expect them to be safe mm -hmm. though my dad did that for 50 years yeah so he's a, he's all right the, my generation can't put guns in their pocket no and be okay all right, let's see. All right, this is probably a you know a closer. Kinda. You, you would think. Yeah. Let's let's see this rubber dummy. Well, you might want to get back a little bit. Rubber dummy? Oh, no, no, you can shoot the rubber dummy from yeah. here. All right, I'm gonna get from here to the rubber dummy. Okay. Yep. All right, you ready? Yeah. Switch gun. I'm on fire, buddy. Bam! Look at that. Mm -mm -mm. All right, I'm getting them. Boom. I mean, every one of those shots hit that rubber dummy, right? Five rounds of 22 Magnum at that at that distance is going to do exactly what you need it to do. Yeah. Yep. You hit some of them in the head, too, didn't you? I was aiming for the head, yeah. Yeah, that's the zombie road rubber dummy. Yeah. Well, buddy, that's a... That's a it's a it's a cool. weird, cool little little revolver. Yep. 
I'm just speechless to tell you the truth. Yeah, I mean, was, yeah, this is almost as interesting as that uh, that that grill lighter gun we. Uh, yeah, yeah. Would you no, consider this to be a survival gun? <laughs> yeah, I think it is a survival gun. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that is so cool though. That's Twenty-two very... Magnum, standard manufacturing, New yep. Britain, Connecticut. That's where the weird water is. Uh, that helps them to make all these cool guns. Yeah. Patent pending. They're they're making some really. They always they, have, but they, yeah, they just they're, they're good doing guys. their own thing over there. All right, guys. I hope you liked this video. You through? Yes, sir. And if you did, like, favor, or subscribe. Keep up the fight against gun control. And remember, as always, Big Daddy love you. I'd say let's go shoot it some more, but I'll, let's go shoot something else. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. See you guys.